Hi guys and welcome back or welcome to Fishy Angler's channel if you first time here. Today I make, make my way to this small pond here to see if I can catch some bass if they start moving. In the past two weeks the weather was kind of iffy. It was going from 70 degrees to 40 degrees and up and down. So I don't know what to expect here and uh, I fished here last time I believe like two years ago. So there was some bass here. So hopefully I can catch some today. Stay tuned. Okay guys, let's just try a crankbait to see if they active and moving or not. If not, then I can switch to something uh, more subtle, slow, slow presentation. So let's see. I mean, there are a lot of trees in the bottom here, so I have to be careful with those trebles here. If nothing bites on a fast moving bait, then I'll switch to, to jig or worm. Guys, <laughs> uh, he he sat in the in the pipe inside there. I just start playing right next to the edge, and there he is. All right, all right, decent bass, nice, healthy looking. All right. <laughs> and off he goes. So, yeah, I cast crankbaits, but had nothing. Then I switched to a Senko and cast it everywhere here. Nothing either, but I decided to drop this creature bait right here in the pipe <laughs> and he was sitting there and grabbed it right away all right first fish so it is kind of slow but what can you do the sun maybe will be coming down and they will start moving a little bit but yeah but this one seated right here so let me try maybe there are some more I guess there's only one who was there or I spooked them when I caught them but yeah it is kind of slow but we'll see maybe more fish will come out to play when the sun gets down
off the shrimp. <laughs> Guys. <Ooh. laughs> wow. All right. <laughs> Another bass. <laughs> a nice fish, not big, but a good looking, healthy fish. Oh, there he goes. Yeah, I hit it on the creature. There you go. So let's see what else we can get here. I mean, the bite is definitely slow, but uh, it's okay. I already caught two. Sure, guys. <laughs> and another bass. Uh, this one a bit bigger. And another bass from the from the pipe. <laughs> there you go. Oh man. They sitting in a pipe down there. <laughs> All right. Uh, I went to to a different spot where I caught that second one over there, and uh, was coming back, and I thought maybe a new fish here, and I just drop it right then and I got another bass so it looks like there's multiple ones hiding in a hole here in that pipe <laughs> and another bass. All right. Yeah, the bass is not big here, but uh, it's nice looking bass. All right. For a few hours of fishing, it's not bad at all. So, they are biting slowly, but surely. <laughs> all right, let's see. I have probably another hour to fish before the sun goes down. So hopefully we'll catch something else. Well, I just got snagged up in the bottom and ripped my rig. So I hooked up a jig. So let's see if we can catch anything on it. Well, and in the summer, this pond gets overgrown completely. You cannot fish any subsurface lure. I mean, it's, it gets really thick. And uh, the blanket weeds pretty much cover 
everything and then they just start floating on top so it's impossible except top water you know if you find like little spots with a hole like windows between grass and just drag the top water there you know hopefully fish will hit if it's sitting under there but that's pretty much it but right now as you can see there are no weeds I mean I'm pulling in the bottom and I get that little bit of that that grass the green one uh, the blanket weeds and that's it but it's pretty much open but there are a lot of stuff here in the bottom like tree limbs and all kinds of stuff I mean and then there is even the water is high right now we had rain yesterday and uh, usually the pipe there you see it's all underwater this is the top of it but usually it's like half open the water is down and uh, when it, when it's shallow like that you can see there's some there's a wall in there kind of like u-shape u-shape over here wall I mean you can even see it when the water is clear well I'm not getting any more bites here in this spot so I'm gonna go to that one over there and just try to cast along the bulrush there and hopefully we'll get some fish there in this spot so let's see just gonna go around try all the spots bites so let's see last time if anything in that pipe over there and look at this the beaver was busy he almost this this tree is big so he almost got it I guess when I come next time it will be out so he started also chewing bark over here so but let's see For the last time I'm gonna drop a jig into the pipe here so maybe 
maybe we'll catch another bass. So let's just do it. Quietly. Looks like nobody's home. Well, guys, there you have it. In this small pond, there's some decent fish. So, with the weather going up and down, so I didn't know what I went to expect here. But it's not bad. This, the, the bite was slow, but I caught five fish. So, that's okay in my book. And uh, I fished only for a few hours. And that was crazy how I caught some fish right in the pipe here. <laughs> so anyhow, guys, if you like this video, hit thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. And I'll see you all next time.